<clears throat> all right, Shalom. 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 All right, first and foremost, we want to give our praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Hashem, Yahweh All right, give double honors to the elders, apostles, and GMS, and salutations and blessings to the Akim around the world, preaching and teaching his truth. All right, with the gym as Memphis Camp. I'm Yakanan. I'm Ina. Brother Quran. Allah. Okay, and uh, the brother Ina has a, a beautiful lesson for us to go into. And uh, I'm going to throw it to him. And Lord willing, it'll be edifying for the elect. Yeah, and, uh, <coughs> name of this lesson is uh, Stay Rooted and Grounded. You know, stay rooted and grounded in the truth, man. So, you know, we can end this and, you know, bug out spirits, you know. Bug out doctrines is coming up, man. Yeah. So we should just stay rooted and grounded in the things we we, uh, we have learned, you know, which is uh, Yahweh Shemesh Shad, uh, the true word, man. What the apostles and elders been teaching us, man. Yeah. So, you know, we're just gonna, gonna get into the uh, scriptures, do the talking, you know, Lord with them, you know, you can <coughs> This is First Timothy chapter 4, verse 16. Yep. Take heed unto thyself and unto the doctrine. Continue in them, for in doing this, thou shalt both save thyself and them that hear thee. You read one more time. This is First Timothy chapter 4, verse 16. Take heed unto thyself and unto the doctrine. Right. Continue in them. Like continue in them. You know, stay rooted in them. Stay grinding in them. The things we have learned. Go ahead. For in doing this, thou shalt both save thyself and them that hear thee. Right. You both save yourself and them that hear thee, man. You know, you are um, fishing for the elect. You know, you save yourself, you know. This word is salvation. Yahweh Shema Shai. That's the salvation, man. You know, go go to the um, second tip. I got a uh, precept. Go ahead, up. Um, this is a... Uh... This is uh, Ezekiel 33 and 3. It says, If when he seeth the sword come upon the land, he blow the trumpet and warn the people, then whosoever heareth the sound of the trumpet and take him not warning, if the sword come and take him away, his blood shall, shall be upon his own head. Right. Yeah, uh, hey, uh, you know, if you're giving that warning and, 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 and the people don't listen, okay, the blood is on them, man. All right, but I'm going to keep going. It says, he heard the sound uh, of the trumpet and took not warning, his blood shall be upon him. So like it. So I, I had it wrong the first time on the breakdown. The blood shall be off of our hands, basically, if we give them the warning. You know, but hey, if they take not heed, man, they don't listen, you know, and, 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 and listen to that warning, man. The blood is on them, man. It says, uh, but he that taketh warning shall deliver his soul. But if the watchman see the sword come and blow not the trumpet and the people be warned, if the sword come and take any person from among them, he is taken away. In his iniquity, but his blood will I require at the watchman's hand. Yep. Mm. <laughs> and we are considered the watchman right yep. now, man. Like we watching the sheep, you know, because these, you know, these false on uh, on uh, doctrines, the women can teach. You know, the uh, two thirds gonna be done away with. Esau can make it in the kingdom of heaven. He can be saved. Mm -hmm. Hey, get one of the sixteen and seventeen real quick. I was just there too. You was. There you go. Yep. Uh, it says, uh, Romans 16 and 17, Now I beseech you, brethren, mark them which cause division. Right, that's what we're doing. We're marking them, man. Watching them, man. That's why uh, we are, what it say, Apostle Paul said, I'm set up for the, de uh, the uh, defense of the gospel. Mm -hmm. You know, that's why we rebuke them, man. And that's love. I mean, you know, we're going off, man. We come to this, uh, to this Bible, man. This, these scriptures, man. You're going off. You're not supposed to be doing it. Supposed to be walking in the spirit, man. You know, and stop thinking on calling me, man. Go ahead. It says, um, and offenses contrary to the doctrine which ye have learned and avoid them. And avoid them. That's exactly what we're supposed to be doing. Avoiding them, man. Not taking heed on today's philosophy. You 
see, but continue to, uh, in, uh, into the doctrine which we have uh, through our apostles and elders of great men's stones, man. Yeah. You know, but taking heed to you, how about you shot this word, man? You know, hey, get Isaiah 8 and 20. What's that? Isaiah, yeah, go ahead. This is Isaiah chapter 8, verse 20. To the law and to the testimony, if they speak not according to this word, we get this uh, Bible, this book, you know, you're not speaking according to this word. Go ahead. It is because there is no light in them. Right. There's no light in them. You have a shaman shine that with them, man. You know, unless they repent and come to the light, you know? So you go back to, um, What's that? Second Timothy? Second mm -hmm. Timothy 3 and 13. Yeah. This is Second Timothy chapter 3, verse 13 through 15. It says, But evil men and seducers shall wax worse and worse, deceiving and being deceived. Right, because we in the last days. Right? The start, you know, second, jump up to verse 1. Oh, sorry. Uh, this is Second Timothy chapter 3, verse 1. This know also that in the last days, perilous times shall come. Right. In the last days, and guess what? We in the last days. So you jump back down to 13. Verse 13. But evil men and seducers shall wax worse and worse, deceiving and being deceived. That's the point. Evil men wax and worse and worse, man. Yep. John the Baptist fell out the truth for so long, man. Yep. Hey, because they, them guys that you're speaking of, they said that, uh, uh, this was the worst doctrine uh, uh, with, with the two thirds being able to make it in the kingdom. We're like, damn, so you know, where's the mercy at, though? Right, you know what I mean? Like, so hey, man, y'all, hey, y'all, brothers, man, need to repent, man. You know, you, 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 you trying to be something you're not, man. Hey, like we was reading in uh, uh, you know, as a, as a camp, uh, in first Maccabees. And tell you about uh, uh, I can't think of the men's name, but they try they were trying to be like Jonathan and Judas, man. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Trying to live up to that, yeah. to you know, yeah. to that standard, to that height, man. That that you know was 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 basically, you know, the Lord blessed those men to be like that. You know, yeah. he was he was yeah yeah Joseph and uh, is it Azariah? Yeah. 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 yeah 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 they trying to. Uh, Live up to 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 uh, what uh, uh, Jonathan and Judas were, but you can't do that, man. The Lord has to be with you, man. Uh -huh. If the Lord ain't with you, man, it ain't gonna. It's, it's not gonna work, man. I don't give a damn what you trying to do. How how you trying to push yourself out there like I'm the next up and coming guy, or you know I'm this, I'm that. No, no, we don't push ourselves, man. We, hey, the Lord is with us, man. It's a lot here. Yeah, I, I, yeah. I beg you up real quick. This okay. Acts 5, let's start at 38. Acts 5 and 38. And now I say unto you, refrain from these men and yep. let them alone. Hey, they bore them. You know? He said, let them alone, for if this counsel or this work be of man, it will come to naught. But if it be of the most high, he cannot overthrow it. Let's happily you be found even to fight against your Habashim Shah. See, you, you fighting against your Habashim Shah, man, because it's not of us, man. Yep. This thing is not of us. We're not, we not pushing ourselves to go out here and say what, hey, Yachanan, Adna, uh, uh, the brother Yanar and Karab gonna do. We, we you know, if it, we we putting our name on it, man. It ain't gonna, it, it's not gonna work, man. We coming in the name of your Habashim Shah, man. We just vessels, man, and, and we're allowing him to work through us. You know, that's how the Lord gets his glory, man. Because we ain't nothing, man. We nobodies out here, man. And yeah. hey, we push the Lord's doctrine. His yep. word, man. This is his doctrine, man. Yeah, this is word, his word. Hey, his word is salvation. That's it. Not us. You know? Yeah. <laughs> hey, we don't want to make a name for ourselves or do man. our own thing, man. Hey, Lord going to give us that in the kingdom, man. That's right. We'll get our glory then. We ain't worried about no damn... Uh, uh, clout or shine, man. That's what's wrong with a lot of these Israelites, man. Y'all want to be seen. Y'all want to be the the new, uh, uh, the new, the new man. You know what I'm saying? I'm the man in Israel. Yeah. I'm the top dog. They want to really be a uh, 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 elder apostle to heart, man. Everybody yeah. shooting for the top crown, man. You know? They don't want to be humble. They don't want to be humble. They want to, um, like you say, as long as ten chapters, they want to uh, establish their own righteousness. Right. And not submit themselves. Man, you know, hey, you remember, you know, and I'm gonna let brothers get right back to it. But you remember when uh, 
uh, what's the what's the head of I, ISUPK, uh, Johanna? He said, "I'm the top guy under the uh, King." Matter of fact, I, I want to say he said under Yahweh Shai. He named he over King David. You know what I'm saying? He the he the top in Israel. That's what that came out of his mouth, man. And brothers know what I'm talking about, man. Yeah. So that spirit is out there in Israel, man, wanting to be the the man. You know? Yeah. So yeah, brothers got it. This is 2 Timothy chapter 3, verse 14. Read 13 again. Verse 13. Yeah. It said, But evil men and seducers shall wax worse and worse. Right, wax and worse and worse. Go ahead. Deceiving and being deceived. Right. Deceiving the congregation, the flock. Mm -hmm. Even this the sheep. You know what I'm saying? Women can feed. Uh, take the mask scene, take the jab. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, you can see even yourself in the flock, man. But uh, like Dr. Nam brought out Ezekiel, the blood will be required upon, required on your, um, on your, on your hands, on your hands. Yep. Like, you know, you got it. But continue down the things which thou has learned and has been assured of, knowing of whom thou has learned them. Right, you know. Keep going. They said remain faithful. Basically, what it's doing is to remain faithful into the thing which we have loved. Man, we supposed to walking up to the truth. You know, hey, you receive the um, the sweet the kingdom heaven for you. Stay faithful. Also, hey, receive that bitter. Yeah. You know what's what the temptations that you're gonna catch here, man. Yeah. You know, they never want to get, uh, eat the bitter herbs, man. Eat the bitter part. You know. He always wants the dessert, man, the sweets. Yeah. You know, I eat my cake first. I eat my uh, uh, cinnamon roll first. You know, but then he you got your, you know, the the the, the uh, horseradish and the onion, man. They still sitting on the plate. Yeah, he like try to go know. dump, this, throw it in the garbage. Yeah, <laughs> nah, you gotta eat that too. Finish that. Yeah, your vegetables. Yeah, your vegetables. Yeah. yeah. They want to throw the vegetables. They want to throw yeah, that you away. Eat the um, Brussels products. Yeah. You, know? you gotta eat it, man. Hey, because it's good for the body, man. It's good, man. Yeah. And this the thing we got to continue in and stay in good in. It said those that endure to the end, the same should be saved. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we got to continue in the good and the bad, man. Catching hell or not catching hell. We still got to continue in it, man. That's right, bro. You know, and, 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 and understanding why we catching hell, man. You know, you got to stay rooted and grounded at the end of the day, man. You know, go ahead. And then from a child, thou hast known the holy scriptures, which are able to make thee wise unto salvation through faith, which is in Yahweh Shah. Right. <laughs> you see, as a child, a newborn babe, you've been born again, man. You know, it's out to salvation through faith, which is in Yahweh Shah, man. Mm -hmm. So you got to continue in this, man. Continue in Yahweh Shah. Be faded. I mean, so I can be drowned and rooted in Yahweh Shah, man. Mm -hmm. You know? Don't let nothing take your crown, you know? Yep. Yeah. Uh, this is Colossians chapter 2, mm -hmm. verse 6. As ye have therefore received a Mashiach, ye have a shot, the Lord, so walk ye in him. Right, walk ye in him. <laughs> Continue in him, bro. You know? And that's about walking in the spirit, being so spirit, being diligent. Put on death for it's still left. Yep. Go ahead. Verse 7. Rooted and built up in him. Established in the faith as ye have been taught, abounding therein with thanksgiving. Why right, abounding, man? You growing. You're not being stagnant, man. You growing, bro. You know. <laughs> Go ahead. Verse eight. Beware, lest any man spoil ye through philosophy and vain deceit. It said, "Be real, mark them. You know, be real, them, man." You see. Go ahead. After. And vain deceit after the tradition of men, after the rudiments of the world, and not after Hamashiach. Right, like we brought up, we Isaiah 8 and again. Uh, you know, it said after the rudiments of, of the world, and not after Hamashiach, the hell doctrine, two thirds gonna be done away with, and so on, man. Esau can make it. You know, the tradition of men, basically, man. You can celebrate your birthdays, you can eat pork, all these. Things like all these vain um, philosophies out here, these strange women, you know, that's why it's all about the net, you know. Go ahead. This is Isaiah chapter 8, verse 20. To the law and to the testimony, if they speak not according to this word, 
It is because there is no light in them. There's no light in them, bro. We got to boil them, man. The scripture says in Revelation 22, I, I believe in 11, uh, uh, him that is uh, 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 unfaithful, let him be unfaithful still. Let him be unholy. Let him be holy still. Are you right there, Bishop? Mm -hmm. Yep. Hey, this is uh, Revelation 22 and 11. Yep. It says, he that is unjust, let him be unjust still. And he which is filthy, let him be filthy still. Right. And he that is righteous, let him be righteous still. Yep. And he that is holy, let him be holy still. And this is the point we come into, man. Yep. You know, hey, Jay can't get it. We moving on. If Jay yeah. still want to believe that the Almighty Microchip is sleeping with white women. Man. It's a it's a philosophy. You know, it's Christianity. Let, Fuck them, man. Let them be, man. Yeah, let them be, man. Hey, because we're at the point now, man, it, it's too late in the game to be trying to break every single thing down to Jake, man. The, the people who uh, uh, come in now and get this truth, man, the Lord going to get him quick understanding, man. Yep. They going to be able to get He ain't going to be asking a, a, a ton of questions, man. You know, not saying there's nothing wrong with that. But I'm just saying they gonna they gonna get it, man. You gonna get it. You gonna get it. Hey, my sheep hear my voice, man. They gonna hear it, understand it, and get it. Because hey, really, this truth is plain, man. When you really think about it, it's, it's when I first heard it, I I just looked. I was like, wow, man. I was like, how how can how can other people understand this? How, how is it that I've been going all this time and I've been in darkness, but the Lord has to, you know, open your mind up, man, in order for you to be able to really see it and and, and hear it and understand it, man. Yep. You have to have that 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 certain switch to click. Yeah, you gotta remove that veil. You gotta <laughs> remove that veil, man. You no, know, because it's not of us; it's the Lord. It's yep. everything predestinated at the end of the day. You know, like the brother was saying, my sheep hear my voice. Hey, that's their remnant, man. I got a quick one to back you up. This is Sirach 39 and 24. It's the ways are plain unto the holy. Ooh. So are they stumbling blocks unto the wicked. See? Hey, well, his ways are plain unto the holy, but so are they stumbling blocks unto the wicked. Because there's certain things, man. Like, hey, say for instance, the uh, uh, speckled bird. Okay, the Israelites, uh, Gentiles, yeah, being foreigners. Gentiles, but yeah. Israelite foreigners, man. You got some Jakes, man, They go, that's going to be a stumbling block unto them. Because they looking at everything in a carnal sense. Well, he can't be an Israelite. The Lord, but he's supposed to look like us. Hey, hey, that's a white boy. Ooh, ooh, ooh. That's, <laughs> he's supposed to look like Wesley Snipes. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. He's supposed to look like Wesley Snipes. You know? Hey, man, that, that's a stumbling block to some people, man. Yeah. You know? And that, that can be into your, your, your downfall, man. Because, hey, that's a part of, of eating the whole roll, man. You know, the Lord has to be dealing with you in, in order for you to be able to understand that. To some men, it's plain. It's plain. Hey, that some of our family members, they got to be cut up and down this side. Yeah. We got to eat that, man. You got to eat that, man. Guess what? You know, the whole road is come for us because the Lord said we're going to see them again in the kingdom of heaven. They're going to have to come back. Yep. You know? So it's comfort to us. We understand why through the Holy Spirit. Through That's God, right, bro. Right. That's right. The Lord told us these things. Family, she betrayed family. Yep. You see, that's part of eating the whole world. It's staying grounded and rooted, man. Yep. If not, you, you out of here, man. You out of here, man. Because if you ain't grounded, man, something small like that can 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 get you out of here, man. You know? Hey, that Esau can't make it. Oh, boy. We were just speaking on that, man. Come on, bro. You got Jake, man, that just got it set, dead set in their mind. That <laughs> he's trying to be saved, man. You can't tell him otherwise, man. Yeah. You know, hey, like the one in the bus said, no one, no one asks about the Chinese, nobody they, on their salvation, the Africans, the A Wells. Y'all are concerned about uh, our chief enemy, oh, Lord, him, the yeah. so called white man. But here it is, time after time, he hates us, man. Yep, he show his hatred, man. But you want to save him, man. How the hell you going to save the one that got everything? The what, is, what the hell do Esau need to be saved from, man? You going to save the oppressor? <laughs> what? Man, Jake, y'all, hey, man. We, that's the reason we got to get the kingdom, man. Brother's been saying that all day. We need the kingdom, man. 
we need the kingdom. We got to get out of here, man. Because it's like that mindset of our people is so gone. Yeah. The Lord just got to, you know, he just got to start this thing over, man. Hey, this place getting destroyed, that's, that's a stumbling block. Oh, man. Because, hey, what Jake you think? Know? Jake think everybody going to go. That's yeah. the way Esau put it out there. He believe Esau philosophy of, of, of the world going in. No, this we talking about America, man. Not every, not not all civilization. That's how Esau wants you to believe. You know, when I leave, everything leave. No, yeah. no, no. That's Esau, that's Esau way of thinking. <laughs> hey, what's that movie on uh, Tenet? Tenet. Oh, Tenet. Hey, that's a spirit. Yep. That, that Edom, he had that spirit. Yep. If I, if I gotta die, everybody die. Counsel, I'm gonna kill everybody. I'm gonna kill everybody. Yep. Everybody gotta go with me. <laughs> that's Esau, man. God damn, man. But our people, our people think like Esau, man. Yep. You know? Yeah. <laughs> we got it up. This is first John chapter two, verse nineteen. They went out from us, but they were not of us. For if they had been of us, they would no doubt have continued with us. Really? But they went out that they might be made manifest that they were not all of us. See? Yeah. So hey, it's certain it's certain uh men that hey, if you if they were of us, they would have continued. They'd still be in this thing. If they were of the elect, man, they hey the elect is gonna make it, man. They gonna get the victory regardless, man. But if you fall out or something happened, you just what you just was not a part of that number, man. You wasn't, you know, <laughs> elected to make it, man. You run, you know, chosen. Yep. What's this? Uh you and man crept in on the web. Yep. You know? Okay, yeah, this is Ephesians chapter uh, uh, four and twelve. Four and twelve. Yeah, this is Ephesians four and twelve. For the perfecting, for the perfecting of the saints, for the work of the ministry. That's Ephesians. Four and twelve. Yeah, this is four. You mean five? Four. Four and fourteen, so like uh, uh, this is Ephesians four and fourteen. It reads that we henceforth come. Uh, this is Ephesians four and fourteen that we henceforth be no more children tossed to and fro yeah. and carried about with every wind of doctrine. Yeah. Wait, every wind of doctrine, man. Hey, one <coughs> of them. The, the earth is flat. Yeah, yeah. You know, that's one of them. And, and many more of the uh, yeah, vain. Yeah, <laughs> many other uh, other uh, strange yeah. doctrines. Man. You know. That the black woman is a god, you know, so on, man. You know? Go ahead. And it reads, uh, to and fro carried away about with every wind of doctrine. Because that's what Jake into. Jake, Jake hop in Islam, one minute be a Muslim, hop back in Baptist, hop, then jump to Buddhism. You can't do that, man. You can't be, um, like you said, go ahead. The slight of men. By, I mean, by the slight of men and cunning craftiness, whereby they lie and wait to deceive. Right, man. So, hey, this, hey, most, hey, can't be chilling, talks to and fro, man. Into this book, into that book, whoop the whoop, you know? Into this philosophy, into baptism. Hey, you stay in Christianity, you finished, man. God. You know? You still believe in Jesus, that Jesus <laughs> is his name, he's the so called white man, you finished, man. You know, you had to say that. Uh, mm -hmm. This is Luke chapter 6, verse 47 through 40, 49. Yep. It says, Whatsoever cometh to me, whosoever cometh to me, and heareth my sayings, and doeth them. Wait, and do them, man. So you show your faith by your hopes. What is the love? What, what did the Lord say? Love me, keep my commandments. Mm -hmm. You gotta do them, man. Go ahead. I will show you to whom he is like. He is like a man which built a house and dig deep and laid the foundations on a rock. And when the flood arose, the stream beat vehemently upon that house and could not shake it, for it was founded upon a rock. So you do the things, what the scriptures say, what the Lord say, hey, you, your house is upon that rock. And that rock is being your house shut. Get 1 Corinthians 10 and 4. This is 1 Corinthians yes. 10 and 4. And did all drink the same spiritual drink, for they drink of that spiritual rock that followed them, and that rock was 
how much you got. Right, so that walk is your yeah, house, yeah, man. Uh-huh. So you do the thing what the Lord has said, you know, and continue with them. Your house is upon that walk, man. A strong house, man. You know? Go ahead. Luke Go 6 and 49. Yeah. But he that hear it and doeth not is like a man that is without a foundation built in house upon the earth. Uh, he said, like a man uh, without a foundation, man. Mm-hmm. So you're not grinding and rooted, man. You want to sell it. Go ahead. Against which the stream did beat vehemently, and immediately it fell, and the ruin of that house was great. Right, mm-hmm. that's just like, um, scripture you say, you build your house upon sand. Yeah. Yeah. You know, sand don't stand. Any of us can you can knock that shit down yourself. Mm-hmm. But you know it don't stand, man. You know? So, right, Y'all, this is uh, First Corinthians chapter sixteen and verse. Uh, I can start at fifty-seven. Yeah, go ahead. Cause this is uh, First Corinthians fifteen sixty-seven. But thanks be to the Most High, which gives us the victory through our Ooh. Lord Yahweh Shai Hamashiach. They say thanks, man. Hey, that's why. So why they have the Most High? Yeah, Yahweh Shai Hamashiach. 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 You know, and most important, you should ask the Lord, you know, pray daily, man. You know, ask the Lord to keep you in this thing, man. Yeah. Keep you in his word, man. You know, yeah. and staying rooted and grounded, man. You should be asking the Lord to pray, you know, pray for that, man. Yeah. Let not the Lord take the Holy Spirit from you. Man. Yeah. You know? Hey, that's the Spirit, bro, because <clears throat> that's something I try to do every day when I pray is, yeah. is uh, make sure I ask the Lord to keep his Spirit upon me, man. I remember uh, coming into the truth and uh, the elder brother from Chicago and said, you know, add that in your prayer. I've been doing it ever since, bro. Yeah. You know, because, hey, the Lord don't need us, man. Yeah, can, we, we not needed, man. You know, yeah, we, we, we're we just mere vessels, man. That's yeah. it. Well, you know, we need, we need you. How about Shema Shah, man? Yeah. You know? hey, that's what I'm supposed to say. Strive for the truth on to death and the Lord should fight for these things. We need the Lord. We, we need the Lord. Hey, we went out. He said, "Was our man to go and pray?" Yep. So, on um, being with tongues, seek him ten times more. Yep. Mm-hmm. You see, we need the Lord, man. The Lord don't need us. The Lord don't need us, man. You see. Yep. Hey, for like you said, I'm praying hey, every day. You think about it. And the scriptures, the day began at evening, man. That's night. So you can pray every night before you lay down at night, man. Mm-hmm. You know. Uh, verse 58 Therefore my beloved brethren Be ye steadfast Unmovable Always abounding in the work of the Lord For as much as you know That your labor is not in vain In the Lord Right man You know It said be steadfast Unmovable man Always abounding Always growing man You see We said labor not in vain What we doing Is a Not in vain Ain't nothing to top this, man. You yeah. want to work for the Lord, man. You got niggas chasing the bad, want to work for you. So, hey, this it right here, man. You know? Yeah. You got a spiritual bag coming, man. Right. <laughs> you got the best job on the, on the, on the planet. Man. Best job on the planet right now, man. <laughs> hey, going on the highways, the byways, yeah. doing the work, man. Hey, Lord called you. He said, men are called you with the chosen. chosen. Yeah. And, and Lord William, we are that chosen number, man. Yeah. We hold fast, you know, and, 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 Ten window and staying grounded, man. You know. Yeah, yeah man. Um, with that, uh, what was that? Colossians. Colossians. Was that it? Was that it? Yeah, I, 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 I think that's one and twenty-three. Let me get there. Uh, this on uh, Colossians one and twenty-three. And be continue in the faith, grounded and settled, and be not moved away from the hope of the gospel. Which ye have heard, and which was preached to every creature which is under heaven, whereof I, Paul, am made a minister, man. Yeah, man. Hey, that's it, man. <laughs> you see? He said, preach to every creature which is under heaven. This word going out. Yeah. They say in Matthew 24, chapter, then should the end come. Yeah. When this gospel begin to preach throughout the whole world, right. then should the end come. Yeah. So this gospel is the good news, man. You know, I'm going to again say, if you continue in the faith, grounded, grounded and, uh, and settled, man, just like the lesson going into, you know, staying rooted and grounded, man, you got to continue in this faith, man, and do all things, endure the persecutions, the afflictions, 
Hey, Jake the Trump, we gotta do all, everything that's about to come to us. We gotta do all of it, man. Staying grounded and rooted in, in that thing. You know? All right, man. He said, um, your, your adversary is a moral lion seeking whom you may um, devour. Mm -hmm. This type of trouble is you. Same. You know? Same seeking. Uh, hey, it's what the, uh, the Lord sifting uh, season? Hey, that's really every day, man. You know? All right. This is uh, Titus 1, I'm going to start at 13, read to 14. It reads, the witness is true, wherefore rebuke them sharply, that they may be sound in the faith, not giving heed to Jewish fables and commandments of men that turn from the truth. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. To the mm -hmm. And we built, you know, that's, that's really love, man. We really correct, correction is love, man. You know, you really think about it. You know, you're not being emotional, you know. So we get the last one, you know. Revelation. You want us to have something else? Yeah, I was looking for one, but we can This is Revelation chapter 3 and verse 11. <coughs> Behold, I come quickly. Hold that no. fast which thou hast, that no man take thy crown. Kind of hold that fast, which thou has, that no man take that crown, man. Because hey, we got this truth, man. We gotta hang on to this with all we got, man. You know, we gotta fight for this, man. Hey, hey, and, uh, what is that in um in the apocryphal where it said the Lord will fight for this? Is that uh, yeah, Second Yeah, yeah, man. Hey, the Lord will fight for us, man. But we gotta we gotta do our part, man. You know, this thing is not going to be just given it to you, man. You're going to earn the kingdom, man. You know? So hey, we got to hold on to this truth, man. We got to hold on to this this, this wisdom, knowledge, and understanding, man, and stay grounded and stay rooted, man. Because that's, that's that's really where, it's all, where it all starts at, man. You know? Uh, uh, once you're grounded and rooted in something, man, you can't be moved, man. <laughs> you solid. Hey, we standing upon that rock, man, which is your shot, man. Hey, okay? And hey, that's what the Lord said, be faithful unto death. That's right, Lord, man. you be faithful unto death, you got to stay grinding and rooted, man. Yo. That's it, man. So, hey, Lord willing, this was an edifying lesson for the elect. Once again, we want to give our praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Ba'ashem, all right, double honors to the elders, apostles at GMS, salutations and blessings to the elect. Shalom. 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 Thank you.